A beach island business is doing its part to conserve our natural resources. The Kimberly Clark Mill has recently received global recognition for its work to conserve water from the Savannah River. And Maxwell live in the newsroom with this story and an update on how they're really making a difference in this community. Ann. Hi, Kim. Conserving water is something Kimberly Clark has been working on for decades. A conservationist tells me saving water in the Savannah River makes a difference for all of us here in the CSRA. You probably have lots of Kimberly Clark products in your home right now. They make paper products, everything from Huggies diapers to Scott paper towels to Kleenex. And they make a lot of it right here in the CSRA at their mill in Beach Island. About, about 2,000 people come to work here every day. Making paper products requires a lot of water, water they originally pull from the Savannah River. Uh, every day it takes about 14 million gallons to make our daily allotment of product. This is how it works. And we take the, these bales of pulp, as they're called, about 500 pounds each, and we put them into a big vat, which is somewhat like a blender. We add water to that to get it into a slurry, and we continue to dilute it till it's very, very dilute. That water orients the fibers properly. Then they dilute it, pulling the water out of the product to make a roll of paper towels or toilet paper. Some of that water is lost to evaporation, but millions of gallons are left over. They reuse about 40% of it to create future batches, and they release the rest back into the river. At the end of 2016, Kimberly Clark received recognition for its water conservation efforts from the Pulp and Paper Institute. Uh, since we were awarded the water efficiency uh, recognition, uh, I'm proud to say that year to date, we've conserved uh, over 900 million gallons of water. So what does that look like? This is an Olympic sized swimming pool. Now imagine this times 900. That's how much water Kimberly Clark engineers say the Beach Island Mill has saved since January. Conservationist Tanya Baratatabas says all that extra water helps fight pollution in the river, which is the water we ultimately end up drinking. It dilutes the waste, right? So the, the solution to pollution is dilution. She says that water is also important to have on hand in the face of droughts. She says every drop counts, and Kimberly Clark treats its extra water on site. Kim, back to you.